Excuse me? What? Hello and welcome back to V-Boys, I'm Steve and this is Distrust and hopefully it's the last episode. So, the first thing I want to get done, yeah, kick in that door and I might as well, yeah, I might as well get what's his name to, well, hang on, yeah, that's right, yeah. Um, yeah, send her here and hopefully we'll find, oh no, he's gone mad, okay. Yeah, I'll be honest with you, I really don't care for it. Um, yeah, if you've seen the previous episodes, you will know why. But I do not want to bitch about it anymore. Okay, that's not the thing I wanted. I wanted to send you... Actually, I'll send him here. I'll send him here. See what's over here. We'll kick down the door. Cool. Right, okay. So we're looking for a battery. Okay, and she's just standing around doing fuck all. Um, I think I'll repair this door actually. Yeah, I'll repair this door. Right, so you're gonna slowly lose health. How many med kits have I got? I've got five, uh, four med kits rather. So I can actually. It is basically a race against the clock here, trying to get shit done. <laughs> oh, I'm not even mad at night vision. Oh, that's not as cool as it sounded. What's wrong? I seem to have um, caught a cold. I need a first aid kit. You'll fucking manage. Do you know what? By the time he gets there... No, there we go. By the time he gets there, what a name will be done with that pick lock and thing. What are you doing? Still making his way over. Okay. Why did I join this freaking squad? Oh, fucking packing in, mate. Bruh. Of course the pick lock would break now. Fucking fantastic. Give them all a fucking med kit. They all fucking need it. More locked doors. At least this guy can knock them down. I'll go as far as to say out of all of them, this is the one I'm wanting to keep. And hello, who's got that? Shakespeare expert, lovely. Might be an idea to repair a shovel. Yeah, repair that shovel. Now, please, please, please. Where, where do we charge this fucking battery? Yeah, good for him. You hungry, mace? You fuck. <coughs> no, you're fucking not. <laughs> Things are going from bad to fucking worse. I'm going to see what happens if I poke that thing. I mean, let's face it, I think he's going to die anyway. Just give me the fucking battery. This episode... Mm, this episode shouldn't even be a thing. We should have ended this in the last episode. Okay. Oh, go on then, law's sake. The creature from the saucer seems to be trying to say something. It said it's not evil, it just wants to go home. It also appears to desire fuel, but we haven't but we weren't able to interpret all of its latest signals. I believe the alien simply ran out of gas, so to speak. Too bad we don't know what it uses for fuel. Right. No, I'm gonna know I was in here before. Fuck's sake, I keep doing that. Yeah, poke this thing. Poke it. Poke it. What's the worst that can fucking happen? Homesick. Well, good for him. What did that do? I feel worse. Cool. Good to fucking know. Looks like this character's fucking dying. Do you know what? No, I. I... If the thing's in here, then I'm gonna want to. Um, I'm gonna want to keep him alive. I know I'm being very careless. There's no point denying it. I am being. Very, very careless, but I'm just wanting to get through this area. Eat it. Yeah, it's basically saying there's mold, there's a chance it can do more. Bruh. Oh no, she got sick. Who's, who fucking saw that coming, eh? No, that's not what I'm selecting now, is it? Actually, 
No, that's not what I'm selecting, game. Good for her. Right, so that room that this fella's in, it's got to be in this room. It's got to be in this building, I mean. And... I am fairly certain I have checked every building. So why, game? Why are you being so fucking frustrated? I need to have this fucking rant. The fact is the first five, the first attempt of recording episodes, episode six through to ten, for some reason, did not record. It said it was recording, and then it didn't. And now during this playthrough, I seem to be getting through it relatively quickly, but it's throwing curveball after curveball. This is taking the fucking piss. <sighs> Fuck's sake, it shouldn't be this fucking difficult. It really shouldn't. Right, send this guy out of here. Right. Send him here. I clicked there. That's not where I'm fucking clicking, game. Can you blame me for being frustrated? Seriously. For starters, she shouldn't be going there. Oh my fucking god, I am so tempted to just abandon this fucking game. This is fucking infuriating. I'm just gonna have to assume. I'm just gonna have to assume. This is just fucking ridiculous. Where are we? Going the wrong fucking way. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Right, we can charge it here. Right, okay. Everyone can survive. Fucking hell, this fucking game. Right. There's a note here. You can charge anything with the generator is working. Sounds like... Got to turn on the generator. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, not all just about surviving. Okay. I've got to wait. I don't know if I like that. No, you're not out of range, mate. It really is not out of range. Do you know what? I think I just caught me lost with this guy. He's just going to kill up in a minute. There we go. He's dead. I really don't care. That battery's nearly charged. This fucking game, I'm telling you. Like, I am literally baffled. Like, I know I've ranted on about it. And I promised I wouldn't rant more. But I think it's justifiable why I'm so frustrated. The first five, the, the first attempts at recording, of course, the first attempts, in fact, for all I know, could I have anything to do with um, the insanity things? I can't see anything past my nose. The only thing I, the only thing that I can help is a long nap. Right, okay. Have they all got that? Well, won't let me select that guy. So maybe it's not a bug. Maybe it's not a bug. But the point that I'm getting at is it doesn't change the fact that I recorded episodes 1 through to 6. And it was a hell of an emotional roller coaster. We're talking one minute it looked like I was going to die. Next minute it looked like I had, I had everything sussed. Then it looked like I was going to die again. Then sussed back and forth, back and forth. And then I did it. But here we are. This time with two characters, and cool, she's hallucinating. But this time we've got two characters, and we're actually going to see the ending. Yep, hop into it. Yeah, he's going to fucking kill up any minute now. In fact, have I got anything? We don't have any proper foods. If he dies, he dies, I don't care. It's not out of range, though. Let me get there. Let me get there. Right. Leave. Jesus fucking Christ.
Right, okay. It's really dark. I should start the generator. It looks like the power to the headlights. Oh no, he's dead. Oh well, doesn't fucking matter. In fact, cancel that for shit and giggles. See if this gives him a decent amount of health to survive. I think it did. It did better than I thought. It's the helicopter. Yes, we're saved. Let's leave this damn base. So much for simple. It says the keys to the helicopter should be in the Major's Timber workstation, which is inside the whatever. I guess it's time to look inside this object. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. It's not letting me. It's not letting me. I don't care for the generator. Oh my fucking god. I am literally at the end of the game. And it's still bugging out. Stop selecting the foot. I don't. I'm. I'm. The cursor is. The cursor's there. That's there. Let. The cursor's not even on the fucking thing. The cursor's not even on it. There we fucking go. Oh my god. Now it's not letting me again. Come on. Come on. There we fucking go. Jesus fucking Christ. This fucking game, I'm going to go, I'm just going to go ahead and say it. I wouldn't even be surprised if, you know, what was I saying before about, you know, recording and didn't record? Here's the thing, recording episode 1 through to 5, I actually had an issue with that, but I was able to solve it. I think it could be this game. Jesus fucking Christ. Because this is supposed to be an epic moment and it just isn't for me. Right. Right. Joy unspeakable. We are thrilled the last human beings in the frozen wasteland have found us. We, proce we process the people who came before you and now you are honoured to become fuel. We have waited patiently for you and can now go home. You are about to experience a great honour. For now, simply wait and you will soon become You'll be soon. To, you'll soon begin to feel your body changing. We, we sense fear in you. No, trust me, mate. It's one hundred percent frustration. But there's no need to be afraid. Fuel cannot escape. The doors to, the doors, of our spaceship won't allow it. A more appreciate, appropriate emotion would be gratitude. As I said the first time I was here. Get a fuck you. Whatever. Two options being, go to hell, bowl and ball. I need to get out of here. And you got the greyed out one saying, I don't want your stupid honour. I'd rather smash your reactor and spill the fuel you have on the floor and get this on the, f on the floor of this abomination. Here's a better idea for you. I'll bring you more fuel and you let me leave. Agreed? Right. Okay, so I can't click that option yet, but... If I tell him to go to hell, and then click on this generator in the back. Oh, we both got full health, cool. Right. I could destroy everything here with a single bullet, but then everyone would die. I also see I could shove something into this reactor, but I don't have anything that matches that shape. Damn. Right. So basically what I said the first time I was here was there are four endings that I'm gathering. You've got one ending where you just stand around and wait. Now, of course, you know my opinion regarding the ending of games when you die. And especially with this game, how I've been doing everything I can to avoid death, I would not be satisfied with that ending. So, of course, waiting around is not going to happen, and then destroying that thing is not going to happen. That, like, key thing or something, what was it? shove something into the reactor i'm going to assume if i put a little bit more time in exploring there would have been an item i would have found clearly i do not have the patience for that 
leading us to one final ending, which is telling him, I go and I'll bring back someone else. So of course we're going to go for that option. More healthy humans who are ready to become our fuel? This thrills us. Waiting is nothing for us as there's no time in our world. Call in other humans if you're sure you don't want to be our fuel. Oh, trust me, I trust me, mate. I am defo fucking sure. This is a great honor. No, we're fucking ain't dickheads. It's time to grab the helicopter keys and to put them to good use. Right. Did I play house? There are times where when betrayal is the best option. His voice didn't waver as he called a, excuse me, a new rescue team to the cursed base, condemning its members to death. The alien process, process was close to reach, I think it says, whatever, close to reaching its goal. It only had, it only had to wait for a new team to descend, to decide to be fuel for the saucer. So basically, what that ending there is saying is gives you an excuse for replayability. So every replay you do is technically continuing the story. But I think it's safe to say that's not going to happen. I think it's safe to say that whereas I mentioned in the somewhere within the first five episodes I was going to play challenge mode. I am not going to be playing any more of this. Hell, I am still low-key paranoid that this is actually recording. Either ways, this game has been incredibly frustrating for me. It's clearly twice as long because of all the shit that has been going on. But that might play out differently in editing. Either ways, hopefully you enjoyed this video and if you have, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. So glad to be done with this fucking game. Like and subscribe.